<laughs> I didn't either. I didn't touch them. Whoever stupid. Why were the pumpkin tools in the crock pot? Oh my. <gasps> oh my God. Iris is like, you why guys... doesn't it fit my head? <laughs> why doesn't it fit my. Why doesn't it fit why? my. You're poking holes in the pumpkin. No, I'm not. You there was already a even... hole in there. No, you poked a hole Where? In there. Right here. <laughs> I mean, it's a good thing. Ooh. <laughs> You're a loser. What's up, guys, and welcome back to Spooktober. Yay! Yay. <laughs> Guys, don't be scared, it's me, yes. Okay, anyways, we're gonna be carving pumpkins today because we already drew on them, you know? So why not carve them? These ones are real, though. Yeah, these ones are real. See? <laughs> <laughs> so while we're carving them, we're just gonna, yeah, because that's what we do best. So important and vital to. This is so important, but he sounds like he's in Xenon. <laughs> zoom, zoom, zoom. Make my heart go boom, boom, my supernova girl. <laughs> zoom, zoom, zoom. Make my heart go boom, boom, my supernova. It's a star. Wow. I'm gonna dye my hair like it. I was gonna ask you that. I was just gonna ask you that. Are you still like gonna try and like dye your hair like that? Or yeah, what? I'm gonna go platinum, bro. Paul's been convincing me. Oh, that's sick. <laughs> the first question that we have is what is your favorite movie to watch during Halloween whether it be spooky or not spooky I don't watch movies during oh do you watch like the episodes or whatever or like shows or I well technically I just watch whatever is like playing on TV so whatever I I'm guess. watching <laughs> <laughs> yeah I mean I don't really choose movies I just go with whatever's on TV. Like that's what I did when I was at my like mom's house too. Oh, like whatever's just on cable type. Mm -hmm. Oh, cause like it, um, oh, it's not even ABC Family anymore. What is it like? They do like that Thirteen Nights of Halloween or whatever. Yeah, I think like so. that type of thing. Mm -hmm. Is that oh, okay? Period. Period. Yes. What do you like to watch during Halloween? Oh. Oh my God. I I mean, this is kind of year-round, though. I watch Scream. I watch the... That's well, actually year-round, though. Yeah, that's year-round. So I'm actually doing this thing. I'm trying to watch 30 scary movies starting in when spooky season starts for me, which is September. I haven't finished yet, and I'm almost done with October. I, I watch any scary movie I can get my hands on. I really like scary movies. This year, I watch Get Ready. Get ready for this one. I watched Scream 1, 2. <laughs> I watched AHS Coven. I watched AHS Murder House. I watched... Dang, you finished both of them? Yeah. Um, I watched Terrifier 1, 2, 3. I watched The Omen, the the newer one that came out. That one's crazy like, as hell. I don't remember. Honestly, I don't that, that gave me some nightmares low-key. Really? Um, no. I watched Texas Chainsaw Massacre, the original, and then I watched Te Texas Chainsaw Massacre 2, also the original, and then I watched the remake from 2003, so I'm at like 11, and then... That's only 11? That sounds like way more. Right? Well, it <laughs> is in terms of hours. Okay, pause. I need to show you guys this because it looks disgusting. It looks like a spine. Look, it looks like a spine. <gasps> Ew, that's gross. Ew. Ooh, Alyssa's faces. Oh, there it is. There it is. <laughs> Ew. Ew. Brother, ew. We watched Halloween Town High, and then we watched Hocus Pocus 2 because I was curious. For me, I really have to watch Halloween Town High. Last year, I watched Halloween Town High four times. That's crazy. I love Halloween Town High. It's my favorite Halloween town. If we're talking about how many times we've watched, like, the specific scary movies then, mm -hmm. I watched Scream eight times this year. Wow. Oh, just for, uh, just for, I watched it twice in October and then the rest were in September. Yeah, I know. I always walk in and my brother's, like, watching it or something. So I'm like, that's why I watch Scream. I really, really love Halloween Town High. It just brings back good memories for me. Sorry. Scary God. Godmother, I love that one. They're all childish things that I'm pointing out. <laughs> it just depends on my like mood. Cause when we watched The Omen, that was like that was pretty that sick. Was that, was the, that was the Oh, we watched The Exorcist as well. We watched The Exorcist. Oh yes, I was actually there for like the that last half. Funny as yeah, well. but like it wasn't even scary, dude. It's that like one was so like funny. No. it's so old school scary, like you know. She just said a bunch of bad words <laughs> and threw up. She said a lot of silly things. She's just a goofy goober. Here oh, I watched, I watched the ter Terrifier too, the last half with you. Those are that's pretty much what I've watched. I just watch a lot of like kids 
YouTube movies. A lot of nostalgic things. I had a sweet tooth that my parents didn't say no to, so. Oh my god, yeah, our parents didn't stop us from eating as much candy as we wanted. That if was... you get sick, then you get sick. Yeah, like they did, they were just like, yeah, go ham. And then we went in. Oh, we went yeah. whole pork. I turned it into a ham, that's what happened. <laughs> no, ham little. Little ham. Lil ham. That's my rapper name, Lil Ham. Lil hey. Ham. <laughs> Lil Bacon. <laughs> Do you know what the fuck to say? I feel like Do a you lot think of that aliens are religious. I, I feel like so. th I mean they have to believe in something, right? Yeah, themselves. What's the scariest ghost story you have lived through? Or is there a story that made you believe? One that will live in my brain rent free is after our great grandmother passed away. Oh. We lived with my grandparents at the time. I think I was like six. Fucking seven. Like I was really young. And I was not home alone, but like home alone outside of my siblings. So it was just me, my grand, and my grandmother, I believe. And my grandma was downstairs and I was playing upstairs. And I used to do this thing where I would unlock my grandparents' door with a toothpick. Steal, yes! Steal my grandpa's stamps and then play with them. They weren't stamps, they were just like stickers that came with his stamps, but I knew them as stamps. They were just like floral stickers like in the shape of like a circle, and I just really liked those and I thought they were pretty. Yeah, the ones you would get in mail. Yeah. And so I was like, oh, like I'm gonna go in there and I'm gonna steal those stickers again. Even though I could have just asked for them, but I really liked the whole the rush, the espionage, you oh. know. So I had to go in there myself and I had to take them after I broke into their room, like type of thing. That is crazy as hell. And so we had just attended our great grandmother's funeral. Good time to play. And um, obviously, I didn't really know her. Like I was like six. Yeah. And Daz had had like a whole thing happen with our great grandmother the yeah. night of the party that we had to celebrate, you know, her death and oh, we you know, celebrated. Her life. Um, and I'd already known that like my mom was like she's like communicating with you guys because you're the innocents in the family. Yaz was the youngest at the time. Hazel did not exist. Sorry. Whoa. Um. Thank God. Oh. So. Yaz was the youngest at the time. I was six, as I said. Yaz was probably one or two, one. I unlock the door and I'm opening the door and it's the weirdest thing. Cause as I open the door, this huge, <laughs> so, you're literally scraping it and it's landing on the I'm arm. like this, I'm like. <laughs> <laughs> the biggest gust of wind just Ooh. like opens as I open the door, like air is pushing out at me, right? And like, I open the door and literally, I hear my great grandmother's voice and she goes, hi. And like, oh. bro, like She's it a scary was woman so, too. that is not cool. That's true. It was so like crazy and it was so like, I heard her so well that like literally I ran downstairs and I told my grandmother, great grandma's here. I literally just said that to her, and Grandma was. Yaz! Oh, Yaz! Shut up, I'm working here! And I was like, I literally, with just full confidence, told my grandma, like, great grandma's upstairs. My grandma believes, too. And my grandma, like, I was crying saying this. I was like, great grandma's upstairs. My grandma was like, well, we're not gonna close the door and you're not going upstairs until your grandpa gets back because he's gonna close the motherfucking door. <laughs> she said, I'm not dealing with that. That's his mom. So she, <laughs> so she literally just like, we stayed downstairs and then my grandfather came home and she like, I don't even know if she told me actually. I don't even remember. I mean, not maybe not the scariest, but it did take my breath away. And the I fully remember running downstairs and telling my grandmother, she's upstairs. <laughs> Like, like, grandma, I'm like she's there. here. I used to talk and play with somebody in my old room. That's true. Oh, I, I used to play in my room, and honestly, like, if I wasn't watching VSA, uh, VHS tapes with Iris in her room, like Scooby Doo ones, then I was uh, playing with myself. Our eldest sister is usually busy. She was 10 years older than me, so you guys have to keep that in mind. Like, yeah, we're all true. five years apart. Yeah. Um, so like that's I wasn't like playing alone like sadly I was I was having the time of my life I had a homie I had a friend in this house that we used to live in and he would sit on top of my toy box that's terrifying I used to sit there I can't get in there I need my toys I used to have like this Buzz Lightyear uh, it was from Disneyland it was the uh, the guns from Astro Blasters oh yeah and it spun go it yeah pew there, pew yeah. and it would light up and everything mm -hmm. and I remember one time my dad came into my room 
which was down the hallway. So the way that it went was our parents' room. Yeah. Then there's a hallway. There's like a loft here. Mm -hmm. and, and then, then the it was bathroom. Our, yeah, it was, was the, it the bathroom or our The bathroom room? and then Arthur's room. Bathroom, Ariane's room, my room, and then Iris's was all the way down the hallway at the end. Terrifying. Terrible. Terrible placement, really. Oh, truly. Especially for a little girl. Yeah. And so, like, he came into my room and he told me to go to bed, but I was already sleeping. So I, like, I woke up to him saying that and he was like, go to bed, yeah. And I was like, I, I, I am. You know, and so then he was like, "Stop playing!" Uh, he's like, "I heard you playing with your toys," and he used to go like, "Pew pew pew!" like the, the like the Astro Blaster thing from yeah, yeah. Disneyland. And so that happened, and um, I remember telling him like, "It's, it's always not our dad." Yeah, I was like, "It's not me." I was like, "It's not me doing that." And then he he was he literally was like, he's like, "Yes, I mean, don't lie." And I was like, "You're right." And so like obviously like I was <laughs> chilling, right. I was chilling, and then I couldn't go to bed because obviously he woke me up, and I was like, okay, well now I'm all riled up. I looked into like I looked over to where my play box was. This is my bed, this is the door, and then this is the play box. I used to have these uh these keys, like they were fake keys, and I used to pretend to drive with them, and so I used to yeah, always have them, that. and so I used to keep them on me, and I realized they weren't with me. So then when I tried to open my toy box, I couldn't open it. Like, I couldn't lift it. And I was like, what the hell? Like, you know, I was like, oh, like, there's so many toys in there. It's, like, stuck. But when I sat back down, he was sitting on top of it. And so was my, like, my Astro Blasters thing was on the floor. And it started going off. And Daddy came in, and it stopped. And then he was like, yes, me, go to bed. I was like, I can't. You woke me up. He was like, okay, well, then stop playing. And I was like, I'm not. I'm playing. Like, I'm looking for my keys. And he was like, okay, I'll get you your keys. So then he got me my keys. And I remember that night, Alta Ariane was in the kitchen for some reason, hella late. And she saw my, one of those like sensor chairs when you sit on yeah, them. Yeah, yeah, And it was Elmo, because yeah. I loved Elmo. And so go she was going time. up the stairs and it was near the stairs. It started going off. I never really told anyone, I guess. Like it just, it was like this dude hanging out in my room. I don't have anything like that. Let's see if it fits. Head check. Uh, not quite. <laughs> I just gotta get in there a little bit. <laughs> so I guess the only thing for me that's happened like that mm -hmm. is more like recently. Ew. Recently? Yeah. That's scary. That's worse. Yeah, I think so too. <laughs> you remember that. You know that it was real. <laughs> yeah, for real. I was home alone, I think. But you know, at my mom's house, I have like the whole downstairs to myself, basically. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What are you doing? I have a pumpkin in a pumpkin. <laughs> I was doing something in the in the bathroom and I had a cup with me. It was a plastic cup like from like a fast food place. And I I don't know, I turned to my phone for something. You reach for your phone. Oh. <laughs> oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Oh. Ew, you look like you had Oh, yes. I turned to my phone. So I was just like ignoring everything, right? Yeah. Okay. And all of, all of a sudden I hear a slurping sound coming from my cup. <gasps> oh my Look god! Next to you? That's not cool at all! I've never had something like that. I've never I, had a ghost steal from me. I'm like, oh yeah, I used to play with this guy in my room and this, this, and this. I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> like, first of all, <laughs> did you Did pay? you backwash? <laughs> How nasty are you? Did you brush your teeth? Not at least for like 1,700 years. Not for real. That is grimy as hell. Could have been so like you've a... never told me that one. No, I've oh, never heard that one. No, no, no. No! Why, why did you think Why would we be react reacting like that? Like that? <laughs> She's like, oh, I didn't? Yeah, I didn't tell you well, that. Well, what did you What did you think? Like, what were your thoughts when that happened, though? Like, I she said laughed. it's real. <laughs> she said they're real. <laughs> no, I laughed because I was like, what the fuck? And then I just minded my own business after that. Did you drink supposed... from it again? I don't remember. You're nasty. You're not supposed to. <laughs> I really? Know. Why do you say that? Because they say that if um, someone is consuming something, it's because it, it'll go bad. That's how you can tell if some. That's why when. Um, oh, like when you set out like fruits and stuff. Yeah. Or... Yeah. And it and for fruits, it only counts like if it's throughout the day. Yeah. Um, because obviously fruits go bad very fast when they're outside. Um, I remember one time I set out fruits and pomegranates and it was like uh like bread, but it was like. I think it was pandesa. Mm -hmm. I set it out for our mom, 
And this was when we were still living at home for a little bit. And it, it went bad in like two hours. And my grandma was so pissed. She was like, why would you leave so much food outside? Why did it go bad? And I was like, um, my mom ate it. And she just looked at me and she was like, okay. Uh, okay, okay, this is for Alyssa specifically. Me? What? Alyssa. What? Would you watch a ghost or horror movie for $500? $500? What the f no? What is your price, Crazy woman? World. It'd be more than that. <gasps> I'm screaming, are you not serious? That bad, bro. You're fucking overdramatic. No. Yes. I thought I would get her with that one. Would you rather be chased by a zombie, a zombie, or a zombie, a zombie, <laughs> or hunted by a werewolf? Chased by a zombie. Those motherfuckers are slow. It depends on which That's one. True. Not the World War Z ones. Well, if you're sick, then it doesn't matter. Girl, because they like yeah. more sickies. Yeah, and I'm pretty ill. I'm Filipino. Ooh. Put that little picture right there too. <laughs> I mean, it's I did it with a sharpie, so now I can't erase it. If you could be in any horror movie, who would you be in the movie, and what movie would it be? Do from Scream. Okay, Alyssa, from your knowledge of horror movies, which is very little. Yeah. Who, who, or maybe, maybe for you, you could just pick a Halloween, like, just like a whatever movie. Can I say who this thing happens? Yes. <laughs> but from where? Which Wednesday, Adams? I don't know. Because I've been seeing, like, because I've been doing research on Wednesday. The little Wednesday, like, the older one. Oh, yeah. Christina Ritchie? She uh, <gasps> seems happier back then. The actress or, or Wednesday? Both. Wednesday. <laughs> <laughs> Both. <laughs> if I was hot, I'd be Billy Loomis. What scary movies do I like? Mm, I wouldn't want to be in any of those. <laughs> Hereditary. Oh. The little sister. Okay, you know, honestly, I mean, I guess more of a Halloween movie. That's my answer. I'd want to be Marnie. Horror movie? I'd want my, like, if I was in a horror movie, like, I'd want my death to be quick. Like, I'm not, I, uh, it's too much to, like, just wait. I don't want to wait. Just, I don't, and I don't want it to be long either. Like, I don't. Where does you know how to answer her own questions? Yeah, that's true. Oh, sorry, next question. Pause. No, you're <laughs> sorry, I was second. carving out this man's eyebrow. If you could visit any horror movie location, like, just where it was filmed, like, where would you go? Or like Halloween movie. Well, now this is kind of hard because it's like my favorite scary movie is Scream. So then, like, I would love to go to Stu's mansion. Can you imagine? That would be kind of cool. sick, yeah. And it feels like all set up. Oh, like decked out, like how That'd it is in the movie. Sick. That would be sick. that would be pretty cool, huh? Right? Twitches. Oh, oh girl. I'm but you have that. to go through her closet. <laughs> Just to get the full experience. Yes. There. I want to go in. to Halloween Town on a little bus, but I also, also would love to light the black flame candle. <laughs> in Hocus Pocus. In their, oh my gosh, in their little house. And technically you can visit Halloween Town, you just can't take the bus. I, I Come did. here. Come here! Oh, it's gonna hit me in the face. Oh, I hope it does. It's not coming out. Did I not? Oh. Maybe I didn't carve it out open. Okay, you know those trends, like from like, not trends, but like those urban legends, like from when we were in like middle school and high school, like Bloody Mary. Oh yeah. yeah. Candyman, uh, Baby Blue and whatnot. Who's Baby Blue? You've never heard of Baby Blue? It's a baby, like urban legend about a baby that suffocated or something. And if you say his name in the mirror three times, he leaves a bite on your ankle. And then, rabid. Yeah, seriously. So, have you guys tried any of them? Yes, most of them. I've tried most of them as well. <laughs> I think I did Bloody Mary. Like in school or? Yeah. Yeah. I think that's it though. You played with the Weeb G board before. I haven't actually. I remember we I went- I am genuinely scared of an OG board. I so am, am too. Our father is too. Oh, our father. That's That was a crazy story. Yeah. I tried most of them. I think that same night, because, okay, so I did Bloody Mary at school, as I said, like was talking about in like our pumpkin drawing video. Mm -hmm. Like I did it at school. But there was one time we went to a family party and our cousin, she thought it would be funny because it was like really trending like among, I guess, like our ages at the time she really wanted to do it and her bathroom like in her bedroom was like it was like connected to her bedroom so like the family party is raging on they're doing karaoke and we're summoning urban legends and shit <laughs> so <laughs> we're upstairs in her room and ever you know doing as kids do screwing around and she's like oh like let's let's do bloody mary oh my god so then we do like um i can't author, believe author Arian did that i don't remember if author was like 
with it. I think she just like, I don't even know if she fought back. I don't remember what She's she did. She's genuinely so scared of things like that. I just remember that we were sitting on her floor in her room and she was like, let's just do it. Like in my bathroom. What? And she literally lit a bunch of bath and body work candles. Real. <laughs> It was those. like it was like two like because you know how like an individual like little bathroom has like a kind of like a small like you know Yeah, so she literally put one on both sides. She's like, okay. 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 Let's close the door This is when I get freaked out cuz I'm like are you serious? Are, we're actually doing it. And so she's like we say it blah 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 like whatever Obviously nothing happens and then we leave the bedroom and then she's like are there any other ones like that and she starts looking it up on like her phone that is you know? crazy she was out to do something then our older cousins our, our older office came and were like what are you guys doing in here and then they were like oh you haven't heard of candy man and so we're oh like, no and so i was like no i haven't heard i don't know what that is and they're like we'll show you and then we did baby blue and i just remember being very scared and i remember going downstairs and telling her mother and i was like hey we did some crazy shit upstairs <laughs> <laughs> and she was like why do you guys do this and i was like i don't know man i have never uh heard that you've never heard that of the movie oh have you heard of that urban legend or uh, no, no. Mm. yeah that movie's really old honestly they made a new one did they Obviously didn't do well. But yeah, so they made us do all that. And I remember telling our mom that I was absolutely terrified. And I was like, what the hell? about dude it's me it's yes <laughs> oh what is that you remember when we went to target we were doing we were getting this yeah stuff? i bought these yeah i told you i was gonna go to self-checkout you said go yeah. help us with the video okay <laughs> thought we were doing this a traditional way not the like oh, fucking construction worker this, this way this is traditional to me now they can't hear us too <laughs> All right, next one's a chainsaw, guys. Get ready. <laughs> <laughs> He's just gonna cut the table in half. Has a horror movie ever scared you so much that it like genuinely scarred you, Alyssa? <laughs> <laughs> I don't like being scared. I don't like being scared either. Why do you do all the things that? <laughs> because you enjoy them, and you're my little brother, so I, by default, have to support the decisions you make or want to make. All right, insert that thing. Aww. <laughs> Where I draw the line is like watching the terrifier though. Like, cause I can't handle gory things. Cause that like messes me up. Like mm -hmm. I have nightmares about that. Cause that, it like makes me cringe. Not like, not like cringe as in like, oh, that's cringy. But like cringe as in like, oh my God. I don't, I don't, I don Why did you roar? Her. Why did you just, you are like, ah. Oh, did you see that? I, I said I rewound. I rewound. <laughs> I rewound. Alyssa, mm -hmm. I got my eye on you. Oh, I'm just kidding. Oh, fuck. You could do um, like a laughing meme. How am I still scraping this shit? Oh, I broke his tooth. Oh, no, I didn't. Okay, is there a movie that you've seen that genuinely disturbs you? Terrifier. Really? It's very disturbing to me. But there are still moments in that movie where I'm like, what the absolute is happening, dude? And I mean that in the worst way possible. That movie is genuinely like screwed up. Yeah, because I remember when we went to Texas last year in January, Ooh. when we went to visit Val, and she put that on for fun because we all were just sitting on the couch. Yeah. And then she was like, I'm going to watch this movie though. Um, The scene in the, what is it? The pizza, the, what is it's it? It's a pizza parlor. It's a pizza parlor. She's going to pop a blood vessel because I his waifu. Um, close enough. I don't know what it is. They did I always say waifu. the wrong. Oh, I always say the wrong thing. Yeah, you always take it to the next level. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. No one said I. Her. Oh my god! I'd burst a blood vessel if you my waifu too. You know what's funny? Your name on my Nintendo Switch is waifu. <laughs> it's waifu. <laughs> I and it's a Goomba. If you were to run into like a supernatural being and fully believe it, like at first sight, what do you think you'd run into? Ooh, what do I think I'd run into? Yeah, like, like, okay, for me personally, I would not be able to believe that I was looking at a werewolf. 
<laughs> like, I'd be like, girl, what? I'm like, oh no, Sung Hoon, please don't. <laughs> <laughs> He's a half vampire, half werewolf. Oh, that as, makes it even better. <laughs> as far as I'm concerned, I don't know. I, I don't keep up with Dark Moon or Dark. Yeah, Dark Blood's their album. <laughs> and I, believe it. Yeah, and like fully believe it on first glance. I can be like, that was that was a Minotaur. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I'd believe a satyr. So I'd be like, okay. <laughs> no, I'd have Percy's reaction like, what the fuck? What are you? Half? What, what? are you wearing? I'd be like, what are you? Half? <laughs> are those some fuzzy pants? <laughs> like, are those some fuzzy pants? You know, I believe that Alyssa would ask that. <laughs> <laughs> are those some fuzzy pants? Like, girl. I, I think I would believe a satyr more than I would believe like a werewolf or a vampire. Because like, what do I uh, prove it to me? Like, okay, no. <laughs> okay, no. No. Because we all saw what happened to Leah when someone transformed in front of her. Just a quick correction. Quick correction. I meant um Emily. Emily got messed up by somebody was it Sam transforming in front of her? Um so yeah. That's why I would not be like, prove it to me. And also, why would you say that to a vampire? You know? Yeah, they would just kill you. Yeah, true. I mean, well, depending, you know, you could end up with an Edward situation. That always happens to me. <laughs> okay, but like, also, like, you're not gonna say that to a safe- Um... You guys, I think his head is too heavy to support him. <laughs> He's kind of leaning. <laughs> I don't know. I know, what would, what, what would you at first glance be like, okay, yeah, I believe you. I feel like it's really hard for me to believe things at first. No, I don't. No, it's bent. Look uh, at is it. your head bent like that, Alyssa? <laughs> no, kind of. I mean like my head like dented or something. No, it's not that strong. I kind of see what you're saying, but like more so like in shock because I feel like wait, if somebody like just transformed into a werewolf in front of you, yeah, that's distance. not being in denial. That's being in shock. That's more so being like whoa. <laughs> that's a distance. <laughs> yeah, because you don't want to end up like um, Emily. Hmm. From Twilight. I don't know. I just, I don't know. I feel like I'd have a hard time believing anything. Even if you're seeing it? A leprechaun. Like, are you really? Yeah, no, like, I, that's exactly why I was like, I'll, I'll just be in denial because I'll be like, that didn't fucking happen. Oh, okay, I see. Okay, that's your response. I yeah. understand, I understand. Because, like, if a minotaur is coming up to you and you're telling me you don't believe him, I don't know what to say to you. <laughs> be for real. She's like, where's the inflatable? Yeah. Where, where's the where's the air thing? She's like, let me unplug it for you. And he's like, that's my tail. <laughs> <laughs> a leprechaun. <gasps> no. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna lie. I would just be like, that is somebody a person. you hired. To dress up in such a way and fool me. There's no way someone that tiny is like doing that. Though. Um, Leprechauns I'm, are supposed to be really tiny. They're not supposed to be like human size at all. Okay, that's Aren't fair. They're supposed to be like thumb size. I'm still 100% questioning it. Fairies. You would believe that? Because that's a moth. At first glance. That's a. That's literally. No, that's a butterfly with a face. <laughs> Move closer. That's a moth. You're that's up. a firefly. Hey, not all of them are that size. Bruh! Ooh, Haven't you that? seen Winx Club? Oh. Girl, we they are the Winx, we are the Winx, come join the club! We are the Winx! Oh... I hate you guys, you know how hard it is? Where's my pumpkin hat? Did I throw it away on that? I, I, <gasps> Be careful! <laughs> it is so fragile! <laughs> um, the Addams Family. I, if what? I saw them, if I saw Uncle Fester, I'd be like... <laughs> that is not a lie. That man is real. That's real. <laughs> I'd be like, there he is. He just looks, <laughs> he just looks like Queen Elizabeth's husband. <gasps> and, um, oh lord. Did it work? Oh, that's great. That looks crazy. If you wanted it spooky scary. You could change the colors? Yeah. Yeah, but the lighting's bad. <laughs> <gasps> my brother looks scary! In the red lighting. <gasps> yes, you look so- Oh my god, ew! Yes, stop! In a zombie apocalypse, what would your weapon of choice be? Gun. You know you run out, right? A gun is stupid. <laughs> Why? What are you gonna use? Why? You wanna know what I'm gonna use? What are you gonna use? You know what I'm gonna use? I'm gonna use mother and fucker right here. Let's get it, baby. What's up? What's up? <laughs> Oh my god. I'm like this, I'm literally like this. Like this. And I'm like, mother, 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 m
Oh my god. I'd use um Negan's thing. Lucille? Lucille. But the bat would break at some point, and you'd have oh. to find another bat. That's the problem. That well, goes okay, for unfortunately, yeah, I was gonna say, unfortunately, everything does break. You're right. Like a knife, and then it happens like what Alyssa just did. It gets stuck in them. <laughs> Bro, come here. Well, technically, I mean, that makes sense. Depending on how decomposed the body of the zombie is, like, the yeah. skull would still be really, you know. You're right. You're exactly right about that. So, that would be kind of hard. So, High School of the Dead. And Michonne. Real. Real. High School of the Dead and Michonne are the reason why I come up, but but like a katana. Because first of all, nobody else is using that. Be real. Like I'm different even in the apocalypse. <laughs> like, she cannot I'm, be based for sure. a machete. Get a longer, skinnier one. <laughs> <laughs> this, those dull so quickly. All so, of them like, do. I don't know. Okay, yeah, that's fair. Okay, okay this is Yaz's. Okay, Alyssa, you go first. Or you go second. It's a snake and it's saying eek. It's like something Alyssa would say. And when I saw that design, it immediately made me think of her. Okay, and then this is mine. <laughs> it's like in the history books <laughs> when they're like showing the different, like the evolution. The of different skulls. skulls. <laughs> Yay! Okay. Wait, wait, wait. Let's put them all at the front. Well, that was us carving pumpkins. Thank you for coming to our yap session and spending Spooktober with us. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching, and we will see you guys in the next video. Bye! <laughs> Why did you stop? <laughs> this is so loud. Then turn it off. It was just to cool the area. It's all up. Because we going to Disneyland, girl. We going to Disneyland, girl. Oh my god! Shit. Stop! This is a foldable table. Well, it's about a fold. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be afraid. It's just me.